Hi! This is Scowl Kitty, and I got a package in the mail today. I just recently got into the whole BJD thing, and I ordered one. An, an MSD Resin Soul May in the lilac skin from Featherfall, and she's not slated to come in until like August. And I got kind of impatient. So I went to the junkie spot and ordered one of the Hujo wings? Yes, that's what I did. In the sky. Blue color. I have no idea where he's fitting in into any th of my story. The MSD has a whole story with her and more eventually. Um, but I was he's more of a narrator kind of thing. I want to do something that's like a um a sort of comic thing with this one. Now, this should just be his body and his eyes. His wig and his clothing won't come till Monday. Even though they're in my city, in the post office, right now. And they have been since 4 a.m. this morning. But they didn't show up in the mailbox. And mail doesn't come on Sundays, so... Anyway, I'm going to open this now and stop rambling at you because I'm crazy and you will understand this. And I, for those of you who don't know, totally got into the BJ ho BJD hobby. I first got interested in it way back three years ago, I want to say. Seeing pictures on DeviantArt and thinking they were actually people. And then I went into actually researching it and realized, oh, these are really, really expensive, nice-looking dolls. And at the time, I had absolutely no money, so I was looking at really, really tiny ones, or the Obitsus. But I never got the courage to actually do it. Come on. And just now, since I actually have a paying job, and I'm not relying on my mother's money so much, I, uh, went ahead and ordered one, and then I got impatient and ordered this one. Who totally is a sort of ambassador for the Southern Isles. Okay, there is, there is a whole hell of a lot of Put your paper in here. And I... Ah! Camera! Camera! I like cameras. Thank you, camera, for your... Oh, don't turn the flash on. I hate... Oh, okay, never mind, you are off. I hate this camera sometimes. It's like, no! We want the, we want the flash! Uh, no you don't. Okay, that is all... paper. Oh my god, he's so cute and he's so tiny! Look at look 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 at this. Look at this face. Look at look look at this face. How could you not love this face? And his eyes. Oh, and I totally there there's oh my god, I love these things. There's totally only one of them in here, but this is awesome. And cards, cards, more cards than I possibly could ever want. I think Oh, and stickers, too. Okay, box. Over there. Let's see. Oh, hang on. Okay. I'm going to take a picture of the mess that is now all over my desk. Um, okay, fine. Do you want Do you want the flash camera? Do you want the flash camera? It does this sometimes. It, it, it starts to hate me for not using the flash and makes all my blur pictures blurry. Come on. Uh, you can do it. I so I'm sorry for the blip. It's wacko. I will take better pictures of that later because that didn't work very well. God, he's so cute. How do I get him out of the... Aha! 
He's so totally bent in like the wrong direction. Or his legs are anyway. Um, for information, the Hujo dolls are plastic. They're not resin, hence why he's not covered in bubble wrap. Oops. And these are the things that keep mm, that keep his eyeballs in his head. I know, I just picked you up by your feet. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Stop glaring at me. Oh my god, he's so cute. I need to put his legs back together. Come on. Sit right, sit correctly. Oh, I think I need to just... There we go. That's why it's not working. His legs are backwards, but his hips weren't. Isn't he just darling? He totally smells like plastic, too. He, he really does. Oh my god, I can't believe I'm holding one of these things. My mother is going to think I'm weird, but that's okay. Oops. There he is in all of his, his blue glory. He totally will not be naked for very long. The clothing that he's getting is really basic. It's a pair of pants and a sweatshirt. And he has this really, like, awesome aqua color wig. But in when he does make his appearance in the actual story, um, it's just pretty much a loincloth and a tunic. He's, an, uh, he's, he's a water nymph. He doesn't need a lot of things. Okay, let's put... Can you stand for me, please? Thank you! Okay, let me grab his eyes out of here. Maybe if I can open the hermetically sealed container. Actually, I don't know how you're supposed to open these. Oh, that's because there's like tape. Okay. You know, I really should be using an exacto knife ow for this. This probably wouldn't be so painful. Aha, there we go. Oh my god, these are these are actually really epic looking. Like no joke. These are going to look totally cool in his head. I was really worried that I couldn't decide on an eye color for him. But these are his eyeballs and they're gigantic so big. Oh my god, focus properly, camera focus. They're so gigantic. I'm going to take his head off. Yeah! Come back! <laughs> Case of the rolling eyeball. <laughs> Stay on my desk. Thank you. Okay. I'm going to take your head off. And This is the inside of his head in its glory with the, the eye sockets and the strings and the, and I'm turning it the wrong direction and the things that hold these things in place. I see things a lot. It happens. Okay, let's not drop the elastic. Oh, I can actually just move the elastic to that one. I think. Okay, this, I think, goes here, and, okay, I'm gonna try not to break your face. I apologize if I actually do break your face. Because I'm convinced that these go on those pegs. That one goes on the little one, the little peg. Stretch far enough that it will work. Come on. Okay, fine. I will take that out and I will put this on and then I'll spin it around. There does not seem to be a clear way to actually do this properly. <laughs> oh, there we go. Okay. I'm just going to shove his eyes in his head. And then probably end this. Because it's getting a little long. And you probably don't want to see me ramble any more than you have to.
Okay, that's actually really. I'm just gonna do the one eye. But that's that that looks really nice. That that eye. And then, I like the fact that it has a peg and you can like move it really easily. Yeah. Okay. So this guy doesn't have a name. He sort of has a location of where he exists. We'll just ignore that his leg is in the wrong direction. And this is my first PJD, though not the first one ordered. And to save you from hearing my rambling for any more, even though I know it's adorable, I'm going to leave it at this, and I will see you all on the next video, be it whatever the heck I decide to say. Cool. Have an enjoyable day.